Hello everyone, welcome back to Forensics with VM. So here I am again with a new video. Now this video will be related to the School of Police Science and Security Studies which is being offered by NFSU which you can see behind me that is National Forensic Sciences University and we are going to directly talk to the Dean of School of Police Science and Security Studies. Uh, I would like to tell you that a newly diploma course has already been added in this particular school. So let's just talk to the sir and would let you know about the eligibility criteria criteria, the fee structure, future score, placements, everything. Without wasting much of our time, let's just directly go to the sir and talk to him. All right, sir. So the very first question should be about your school, which you are running as you are the dean of the school. Can you please tell me something about the School of Police Science and Security Studies? You see, uh, when the university was launched, uh, the, our Honorable Vice Chancellor, Dr. J.M. Vyas, was very clear that it is not going to be the university only for forensic science but all subjects which are allied to the forensic science and accordingly way back in 2012 he launched a course in homeland security in collaboration with a foreign university and since then we had been running this course successfully seeing its success the vice chancellor took further uh, major stride forward and he said that we need to widen the scope of security studies and that's how this school of police science and security studies has been launched which is encom which encompasses all kinds of security studies and police related administrative studies all right sir as far as i can see we are running two dip uh, two diploma courses and two masters courses in the school so very first course is msc homeland security and then other is ma police and security studies we are also offering pg diploma security studies and one more which is newly added that is diploma in canine forensics so before that i would like to ask you like what do students study in the two masters courses that we are offering here you see the way environment is uh, developing all over the world including in India there is a huge requirement to have security executives in every kind of installation in every kind of industry corporate sector you need security executives and gone are the days where you could uh, manage with a retired army officer or a retired police officer because the threats are such and they are so technologically uh, involved that uh, you need to have a formal training in security to become a security executive. So with that in mind, we have launched these two courses. The MSc Homeland Security is a comprehensive course starting with uh, international security down to regional security to India's internal security and thereafter we go down to the installation security as to how it is to be planned, how it is to be managed okay. and all associated subjects related to that. Okay. As far as the MA course is concerned, the focus on technology is little lesser. Well, in MSc we touch upon and we give an exposure on to advanced security technologies like artificial intelligence and uh, data, big data analytics and uh, uh, machine learning and things like that here the focus is little lesser that's the difference otherwise by and large they are quite similar all right um, can i ask you about the eligibility criteria of these two like for msc what is the eligibility criteria and for ma who all are eligible for this course see the blessing in disguise is that there is no counterpart for these courses at graduation level so for msc homeland security any science graduate okay who has got 55 percent plus marks yeah. is eligible okay and as far as the ma in police and security studies is concerned any non science graduate all right that means he could be a commerce graduate he could be arts graduate or anybody law graduate he could join and uh, enlighten himself all right great to know sir uh, let me uh, just ask you what are the future scope of this particular courses that we are offering the masters courses as i mentioned you know there is a huge demand for uh, trained security executives yeah so all our students who have passed out in the past okay the homeland security as well as police and security studies they all are absorbed in the various industries okay we the fourth semester is dedicated to internship the whole sole purpose is that they get first hand uh, experience of practical working mm -hmm. so that they are absolutely industry ready when okay. they finally graduate from this university great 
and uh, i would like to ask the very favorite question of the students like uh, does the university offer placements after this particular course is completed 100% 100% oh, placement i can i can assure you that in all of our previous batches each and every student has got a placement yes it may take few months in few cases but it is safe to say that within within about 4 to 5 months everybody finds placement most of them find placement in an industry where they had gone for internship itself and we all uh, we send them to all major industries of the country All right, so very nice to know that. Okay, sir, but I am curious to know, like, since we are already running the master's courses, wh what is the need of running a PG diploma course in the same domain? You see, what has happened is over the years, uh, there are large number of uh, officers, executives, security executives, who have been working and have gained experience, but have never got the opportunity to have structured training. Okay. Not do they have any formal degree? Yeah. so this diploma has been introduced precisely keeping them in mind okay so nice. that they get a value addition mm -hmm. by virtue of structured training okay. and they also have a diploma from a reputed university like uh, ours yeah. that is the idea yeah okay and uh, what would be the eligibility criteria for this diploma course pg diploma course we have kept it open for any graduate okay. irrespective whether he is science graduate arts graduate whatever as long as he is a working professional or even a youngster okay. wishes to do 50% in graduation is all that we are looking for all rest right. we rest you leave it to us yeah okay okay sir i would now like to ask you about the very newly added course that is diploma in canine forensics and i hope uh, i believe that there is no such university that that is offering this particular course and nfs you have taken this initiative to start this particular course i would like you to throw some light on this course you see our honorable vice chancellor dr vyas he always wants to take some initiative and widen the scope of studies every year yeah so after having established the school and starting the master's course and pg diploma then he said that while we are focusing on technology what about uh, bringing in the dogs also yeah. they also are a major players as far as security is concerned correct correct and that's why then we started working on it and now we are introducing a diploma in canine forensics wherein the utilization of dogs in the security uh, duties as well as what we call is in sniffing or detective duties in detection of narcotics in detection of they are even used in avalanches and all finding out bodies even in disaster management yes sir, exactly so this is with this in mind we have started this diploma course and what has happened is that over over the years these courses are being conducted in army mm -hmm. in the armed forces in the paramilitary forces in police yeah. so they are, these courses are restricted to the people who are actually working with dogs only yeah whereas there are large number of youngsters who are dog lovers and who want to carve out a career in this field so this is again the same purpose that the existing experienced dog handlers they can get structured training mm -hmm. and a diploma here as well as the young people young students mm -hmm. who wish to make a career into it okay. and are dog lovers okay. they can also be uh, join here and do the training yeah sir but what is exactly eligibility of this particular course very basic we have just kept 12 standard pass this is not a pg diploma this is just a diploma and it's okay. a six months duration all right and we intend to conduct a simultaneous training uh, for dogs as well as the students okay. so that they form a team and uh, thereafter they can work together in future if the opportunity comes up their way all right yeah. so which campus will be offering this course this will be conducted at delhi campus okay yeah and we have tied up with uh, one uh, dog training school okay so along with that it is going to be a combination of dog training and the forensic science all right all right with an, with an overall envelope of security yeah so and what is the fee structure of this course 20000 rupees for the course okay. it's a just 6 months course so 20000 rupees okay so is there any special message which you would like course, to deliver to the of students course. you see this is a unique school and it runs unique courses in fact till date there is no other institution or university which runs a masters course in homeland security so we are always in the lead and uh, our students get placement in about 4 to 5 months time that has been the experience so far so here is an invitation anybody and everybody who wants to venture into security related studies is most welcome time is running out 29th may is the last date do apply on the nfsu website 
and you are welcome to the school of police science and security studies yeah so i hope all your queries related to this particular school would now be resolved because the dean himself is here to you know to resolve all your queries so you all are welcome to uh, join any particular course in the school of uh, police science and security studies and if you have not subscribed to the channel yet you should subscribe of course <laughs> <laughs> yeah and uh, please take care thank you so much bye 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 thank you